The longest running outdoor haunted attraction in Illinois is back for its 38th year. Spook Hollow in Marquette Heights is open for the season and here to tell us all about it, Ryan Gardner. Good morning, Ryan. Thanks for being with us. Good morning. Thanks for having me. So this past weekend was opening weekend and you said there was just so many people. Oh, we had a blast. Yeah, Friday was a little slow. It's always that first day jitters. And then uh, Saturday we just we got slammed. It was a complete blast. We had a lot of fun. Now you've been a part of this for 20 years. Mm -hmm. Why did you initially get involved? Uh, actually, a friend of mine from high school got me into it. Uh, he said, hey, you, know, you ever heard of the Spook Hollow? Yeah, yeah, I have. You want to come work it? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> you know, and, and we've been scaring them ever since. Very good, very good. And it's all for a, a good cause, is that right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're actually uh, 501c3, not for profit with the IRS. Um, outside of our operating cost, every single dollar goes back to the community. That's very good. You said that was important to you, being a dad. Yeah, oh, yeah, for sure. It's all about the kids for me. Absolutely. So. Where do you guys pull inspiration from every year to make it new and exciting for those who come every year and make it a tradition? Well, I hear very often, you know, when do you guys plan for this stuff? And, and I always say November. I mean, as soon as we're closed, we're thinking about the next really? year. Really? It takes all year to think about, all right, you know, what are people scared of? You know, how can I get them out of their comfort zone? Sure. And uh, we always just kind of play on that and run with it. Do you do your research with like, uh, I don't know, American Horror Story or those sort of things? <laughs> a lot of us are really big horror movie fans. Okay. And we kind of play on that a lot. Very so. good. What's your favorite part of scary people? My favorite part of scaring people? Yeah. Uh, that reaction, <laughs> that, 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 that awkward moment, the, the you're too close to me, this is creepy, you know, mm -hmm. and, and it's, it's, yeah, we're here to scare you. It's a family event, but we're going to scare you. Yeah, you said one of the tricks is invading that personal bubble. I, I get in that bubble really, really good. <laughs> Yeah. Any memorable scares over the last 20 years? Oh, um, there's so many of them. I, yeah. I wouldn't even know where to start. Uh, my, my favorite ones actually are the little, little kids, the ones that are, mm -hmm. you know, not even waist high. And, and they're never the ones that are scared. They look at you, they smile, hi, you know, <laughs> yeah. and, and it's, they don't know what to do. And their they're parents fearless. are usually freaking out, mm -hmm. you know. We, we have a lot of fun with that. <laughs> That's awesome. So the line pretty long, like you said, Saturday. Is there any way you can sort of uh, get past the lines? There is a fast pass option. It's our RIP pass. Uh, not VIP, <laughs> RIP. Uh, th there is an added cost, but it cuts you through the lines. And um, there's always entertainment in the lines as well. We've got videos and music and actors running around and everything else. So. Okay. Do you recommend getting tickets ahead of time? You can buy them online on our website, spook Uh and You can absolutely buy them online, bring them on up, and we'll get you right through. Awesome. Ryan, thank you so much for stopping by this morning. We're going to post all the information on this year's Spook Hollow at our website, ciproud.com.